What up, guys? This is my um, review of the, um, the KGW G23 right here. As you can see. Yeah. It's actually one of the nicest Glocks that I've owned. Except it does not have um, trades on it. Only bad thing. Like over here, when you would have your trades for the, um, uh, for the, for the, um, the Glock and all that, Australia and all that, it just has its KJW works right there. But yeah, I'm going to give you an overview of the gun. So the gun shoots about 350 FPS, barrels, you know, tiny, so it wouldn't be shooting that much FPS. Green gas, propane, all that good stuff. Um... Magazine holds a good amount, probably I would say about like 20 at least. Um, mags aren't that expensive, about around $30. Um, gun does lock, you can see that. You got a, you got your own button right here. You it like that. Got a hammer inside like the real Glock does, obviously. Um, it's actually easy to take apart too, what you do is... Um, Pull back these two pins. You got this pin, this pin. Just press that down, and then release the slide lock. And you got your bottom piece right here. And you got your top piece right here. <laughs> so yeah, that's that. Safety, safety. You know how a real one it would be right here. This shit right here that you um release the lock um doesn't have that here. Actually um safety's down here so it's a little hard if you have gloves on because it does require nails. So it'll be hard to um you know it's good. Also <clears throat> it doesn't have a safety on the trigger. I don't know if you can see it, but it's supposed to have like this another loop right here, but it just like comes clear. But you you could always replace it. KGW, um, they actually, um, they're compatible with all the Tokyo Marui parts, all that. So, yeah, it shouldn't be a problem if a part breaks or something. I've had this gun for a while now and it hasn't broken on me. Do recommend getting one. I don't think they sell it for, like, the full gun. I think it sells, um, two parts differently on e -bike, the slide, and then you gotta buy the, um, the frame. But it's both, like, $60. <clears throat> I don't think they sell the green OD green that you see here, not sure, don't take my word for it, pretty sure they do, <clears throat> but I guess it's hard to find, unless they restock their own e-bike, and um, yeah, that's pretty much it, <clears throat> sorry my voice is fucked up right now, and um, yeah, it's pretty much, oh, when it, first you get the gun, it comes with an orange tape, you can just take that shit right off, pretty simple, but um, yeah, it's pretty much it, got nice, nice white iron sights right there, as you can see, um, you can see the side. The um the um slide has in these two holes right here. That's a nice yeah, there you go. It's nice and also the outer barrel has those holes too, so it's really nice. Um you know, you press it back and you try, you know, releasing it this way it won't work. Take out your mag, hold it, then you um do it. And it will do it, but with the mag inside, you can't do that. I mean, it's not that much of a con. Uh, another con, you know, the slide, the safety is a con. Um, it's pretty much it, not really much. You can get um, a silent arms, forgot what they call it, that you get um, slides for the, uh, exactly for the KGW G23 that has official trades on the uh, G23 Australia G Glock right here and then you could get a frame for $30 that you know got you know got the Glock shit right here got the Glock symbol right there and then they got all the Glock engravings and where it's made all that right here and there's different types you could get there's different colors of frames tan black OD green that you could get for 30 slides cost you know a little more and the high end price about 120 each to a hundred dollars it's all worth it i mean it's only air so i'm not trying to make it look that realistic you know but um probably planning on buying it in the future not right now but yeah that's it um stay tuned for my next review which is going to be my more sock kit stay tuned for that i will um definitely keep you guys posted on that 
follow mine and Ben Instagram page Recon Six Airsoft. Um, we'll spell it out on the screen for you. And yeah, that's it.